Welcome to another video from the, the Thirsty, Thirsty Thrifters. Thrifters. Cheers. And we are taking a break from wine and having a diet root beer and a diet ginger ale. But Dave will tell you about what we had last night. Oh, my name is Tara. I'm Dave. And I'm a part-time reseller on Poshmark. And my closet name is Tara Stutes. And now he will tell you about the wine that we drank last night. This is one of our favorites, I think. Yeah, it's 19 Crimes, The Banished, it's uh, called Dark Red. It's just a nice drier. Let me see it. I heard that one. there's like a, co a QR code or something on these that you can scan and it will give you details about the criminal on this, but I don't see a QR code. I don't know. I think that's a uh, urban myth. Or you can Google that. Urban legend. <laughs> let, us, let us know if you like our new lighting and setup. We had to get a ring light because Dave destroyed my umbrella lights. I've carried them up and down the stairs <laughs> around 20 times now, and that has taken the toll on the umbrellas. And the cats knocked them over a lot. So we have a ring light, and um, kind of hurts our eyes. We're going to see how this goes. I'm just going to be looking like this the whole yeah, Today no, is a, we're going to do a thrift haul. Uh, first we'll do some things that I've bought over the past week or so. Uh, we did go to a Goodwill half off day and Dave let me stay for about 5 minutes. No, 30 minutes. Not very long. I didn't get much. So I got those things. I have a few things from our local Goodwill. And then we'll end with, we just got back from the Goodwill outlet in Indianapolis. And so let's start with the... Um, other things. Yes. I didn't s separate these properly. Oh well. So, okay, this one, I haven't decided if I'm going to keep it. This is like an insulated lunch bag kind of thing, except it may be actually for makeup because it's Avon brand, but I like the pattern and I may keep it for myself. You can't do those. Those are the outlet. That's what I said. Well, I didn't separate well, it. Why right. am I in the video? Just here, talk about these. We got those here, a half off. Found day. these shoes. You have this to light say what sucks. brand they are. It's, like you can't even see. We'll figure it out. I promise. What brand are those? I don't know. I got like five pairs of shoes at Half Off Day. Some brands I never heard of just to kind of explore. Prevo. Prevo. So we'll Prevo. have to see if Prevo is any good. You can do these in, in a minute. Okay. I got these because they felt expensive. Okay. I can't say it. Dino... Bigioni? Bigioni? But they're, um, I found out this is a pretty expensive brand. They're like perforated suede men's, probably driving shoes, they probably called. But, um, hundreds of dollars new. So we'll see what those are going for. Size 44. What's that in men's? Do you know? I don't know. They look fancy. <laughs> Do a tie. He picked out some ties to try to sell. Uh, this is Brooks Brothers. Two of them are Brooks Brothers. They're not terribly ugly. Let's see if I can sell them. I like that one. If I had to wear fancy clothes, I'd wear something like that. It's like that. a, it's like salmon color. I like salmon. And blue. Okay, I got these at a local thrift store. And if they don't sell, I might keep them. They are Lauren Ralph Lauren ballet flats, but they're bright gold and shiny. <clears throat> well, those are shiny, especially with that sh bright light. <laughs> I don't. I don't know face. how to show you tags anymore, guys. I hate this light. We may just use this for my photos. And was this thing expensive? Because I yes, it was. Want to break it? You were supposed to do ties separate. Okay, uh... Here's another tie. <laughs> what brand is that Bruno one? Bruno Rossi. He looked these up, I said, sure, we'll try them. I think well, they were a dollar They're each. a buck a piece. It's like, I, I can't lose. I can, uh, give them to somebody as a gift. Who wears ties that you know? I don't know. All our friends are bums. <laughs> Whatever. Work from home like us. I got some dance goes. Size 37. And 
don't know about those dance goes. Hey, the fr I bought two and they sold quickly. And we, at the outlet tonight, I had one that was a little bit too worn that he made me put back, and then I had two singles. I couldn't find the match. You found two pair of North Face, North Face, They're, North, North face. face. They're North the face same. Pants. They're matching. Matching. Size six hiking pants. These things are awesome. I'll put them together to sell. Shh. Yep. Nice find, Tara. I bet they sell. I think you were with me. That was, that was half off day. I got those in my 30 minute allotment. Okay. Here. I gotta tell you, this isn't as much fun without the uh, wine. Talk about those. I picked those out. These are... What are these things? Tassels. Tassels. Tassel Tassel shoes. I don't have any friends that wear these. <laughs> I know that much. <clears throat> Cole Haan. They're Cole Haan. Cole Haan. These I are... bought a pair of Cole Haan with tassels and they sold pretty quickly. Are these for guys? Yes. <laughs> I hope so. Oh boy. Okay. Here's another thing we got. What, what kind of event do you wear shoes with tassels to? The bar mitzvah. Okay. I don't well, know. I've never been to one of those and that's why I don't have those kind of shoes. These are soft. They're tur turquoise blue and... Size seven and a half. Seven and a half. It looks like 7.75, but I don't think that's a real size. So those are these. Um, it's probably on the bottom or under the tongue, or they're in there somewhere. Maybe not. Okay, we're gonna move on to things I got at my local 11. Okay, I think. They found it. My local half off, no, it wasn't half off day. It was last Sunday, so some things were a dollar, but I did get a few things that were not um, discounted. You want to no, show but... those? <laughs> these were a full price. Ooh, Lululemon. Yeah. Yeah, these are so. But they're wide leg, which is my favorite to wear. They're wide leg, like, kind of t-shirt material, so they're not the Luan tights or anything, but... They still have the tag in them, and they look in very good condition. And what else did I buy? I have forgotten at this point. Uh, oh, I got some Torrid leggings. They were $1. I haven't been buying much Torrid because it doesn't sell. But these leggings is a possibility. They're size 2. They have a pattern to them. And we're going to... I don't know if you can see anything with the like oh yes you can it's like leopard print kind of there you go <laughs> that's better <sighs> okay you show off this thing i bought this is the most i've ever paid for something i think and the only reason i did is because it is my size so if i can't sell it i can wear it oh it's the burton yes this is a uh dry ride burton dry ride coat ski coat Brand. This is for real nice. Look at this. I mean, this is just really good quality. Can you hear him behind the curtain? Super quality. If you didn't hear that. Tara should keep it. Or I don't wear red, so... We're going to try to sell it. Okay, I think these are a dollar. How much did you spend on that? Ten dollars for that coat. Well, that's not bad. I bet it's worth way more than that. I should be able to at least make ten dollars back, but I will put it aside for next uh, fall to list. Theory size four. Little pleated skirt. <clears throat> Orange, I think. Orange. You want to do those? <sighs> Adidas. Are these like uh they're crazy print wow got some interesting zebra some leopard i think they were finally a dollar i'd seen these week after week and <laughs> didn't want to spend 450 on them but they I... were a dollar they do that one what is it what is it athleta surprise surprise oh it's... yeah that's the, the one that's got the weird Sides. Ruching. And Ruching. Yeah. Ruching. It's like a dark blue, purple-ish. 
It's hard yeah. to tell colors right now. Yeah, I'm blinded by the light. This was my best find if it's real, and I have no clue if it is. Yeah, that thing. It's got a... You were telling me about that. It has no size tag, no tag telling what fabric it is. It feels like kind of like the St. John knit material, if you know what that feels like. But it's got all these... I don't even know what you'd call them. They're not sequins. I kind of want to try it on and maybe. But that's oh yeah, look how shiny it is in the light. Maybe wear it once or twice. <laughs> I gotta try it on, I guess, to see what size it is approximately. So that's everything I bought at a normal thrift store over the last week. And now we can do our outlet haul, which is the weird stuff. All right. We just got back, oh, yeah. and I've forgotten half of what we got. These are North Face corduroy. Yeah. <clears throat> I'll Jeez. put those aside for the fall. I I like to list seasonally because I don't like to look at stuff for like six months until I know it's the season for it. These so are cool. I'll just put it aside. That make that means I can thrift more. You got the number A5 on them. I don't know if that means anything, but all the zippers work and stuff. We haven't checked the multiple pockets for money yet. Yeah. We should. Okay, let's see. My first thing. Okay. This was um, strange. Size small. Oh yeah. Polo. It's like by Ralph Lauren. It's got the but it's elbow pads. It's like it's for playing polo in. This is all embroidered like patches with embroidery on them, gold and so because of the big logo, big uh, brand name, I thought maybe that'd be a good. Built-in elbow pads. It's very thick and nice material. Very, very thick and nice. Actually, I kind of want to wear it once. Oh, here's a t-shirt. <laughs> this is the Atari t-shirt Tara found. I thought it was cool. This is junk food brand. First time I've ever found junk food. It does have some like color transfer on the back. Let's see if it'll show. Oh, yeah, everything's gonna show in the right here. White. Oh, it's, no. it's a little bit pink there. But I'm gonna wash it well and. But it's Atari and it's junk food. Cool. So some person my age is going to want this, I bet. Okay, my turn? Yeah. Sorry, I have to comment on things. Athleta tank with like a little twist in the back. A little detail. Size small. Orange, like burnt orange color. I bet I'm going to get all the Athleta if it's not really old. I found this. This was with tags. Joe Boxer uh, hat. And if no one buys it, our kids will wear it. I'll keep it. Dave's special. That was my owl joke for the evening. I think these are Dave's jeans. These are yep. Levi's Levi 550 jeans for Dave, and they probably cost $4, so you better wear them. I'm gonna. They were heavy. I could have put them in the basket over here. It's your turn, though. Pick something else out of the bag. Don't tell me what to do. Ooh, Adidas. Uh, yeah. hoodie. It's like a crop link. Did I find link? this? No. I think crop I found link. that one. I did. I, you inspected it for me. It's oh, yeah. blue with blue embroidery and blue stripes. Yeah, that's cool. They found turn. these. Oh yeah, I did. Nike dry fit. They're tiny. Shorts, extra small. This will go the in a, probably shorts. a lot with other extra small things. Or my sister-in-law will take them if they don't sell. I'm guessing she'll take them. The last time my clothes were that small, I was in like fourth grade. I've never worn extra small. These are vintage reserve. These are Joe's jeans. I have never purchased Joe's jeans to try to resell, and I found some that are... Oh, Joe's. <laughs> I just said that. Joe's. They're distress, and they're skinnies, and they're at the outlet, so this will be my foray into Joe's jeans. I know Vintage Reserve, usually for wine, <laughs> is a good sign that it's going to be expensive. Big Star Matty Bootcut Jeans. I think I just sold a pair of these last week or something. Those 31 XL, so it's a larger size, and they're tall. Extra XL means they're tall. 
so just boot cut jeans to sell for like 20 bucks probably speaking of boots here's some boots these are toms toms and they're like suede perforated kind of like the lucky brand ones we just sold yeah are they um, okay are they supposed to be like that yeah they're slouchy <laughs> they're slouchy on purpose, on purpose huh? okay. so i will probably put those aside for the fall again the cat's climbing up the screen oh my god Okay, I got J. Crew. Get down, cat. Uh, shorts, swim trunks, size 30. Oh, yeah, those are cool. <laughs> this cat has destroyed our curtains and our screens and our lives. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say it. Antoni Milani. Antonio, there's an O. Antonio. Milani, sorry Antonio, I didn't mean to mispronounce your name. I've heard this brand before, and look at that. I like uh, the, the pattern on it. Hound's tooth. Cool. Hound's tooth, and Is it's that what like that's called? I believe so. Cat. Uh, they're She's fuzzy, so like um, can't think of the word wool or uh, tweed. I don't know. They're size seven and a half, and I they're in really tweed. nice shape. Put it tweed. over there. You know my problem Tweety. with tweed. I don't like it. That's your problem with it? I don't okay. like tweed. Here's a choice from Dave. The cat's going to have to get down. <laughs> I'm going to have to do something about this. She's... That's not hail. It sounds kind of like it's hailing. <laughs> I can't believe she <laughs> chose right now to climb our screen. Fast Pro Shops hat. I, I have Just... no idea if these will sell. <laughs> But Dave wanted to buy it. Trucker I said, hat. I said, it's cheap. We'll give it a shot. Give me something to throw at the cat. No. You will miss. <laughs> I've got a couple bras somewhere. This seems like a good time for me to go get the cat off the screen. Okay, go ahead. I'm going to talk about bras. Super. You do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got two Victoria's Secret bras. Same style. One is the nude color. This one is black <laughs> and gray. They're both 34B. I'll put those together and sell them as a bundle for like $20. And I got this for myself. Under Armour sports bra. Hopefully it fits. <sighs> he brought the cat. She can't be trusted. All right, next. Need lock her in her room. So those, there's those jeans. These are these weird. Okay, they're kooky. This is how you say that, right? Kooky. They are. They have weird embroidery here. Um, they're very fancy they're jeans. Like, I wouldn't wear them personally, but there's guys there's that really would like pattern those. Pattern on there. Here's some on the back. So I heard this might be a good sell. Um, We'll see. That'll be our first time trying that. Is your phone ringing? My phone ringing. is right there, Tara. Jeez. Oh. Huh. <laughs> uh, you sure I'm you tired. haven't been drinking? I'm positive. It's your turn, though. Coogie. Coogie. <laughs> oh, I like this. This is pretty cool. This was... This is a strange find, and this is either going to never sell, or it's going to be very popular. Oh, wait. There it is. I didn't button it up all the way. It's a, yeah, Lacoste cost. vintage dress with these little stripes and colorful buttons. It's like a shirt dress. It does have a little stain on it that I'm going to try to get out. Uh, right there, can you see? Was it polyester, probably? I can't see anything. Oh, yeah, it feels like polyester. It feels like genuine Lacoste. Yeah. Cool. It's got the alligator and everything. Got the gator. What is this? I don't even remember. Oh, those oh, are the Columbia. Columbia pants. They're the most wrinkled pants. They won the Guinness Book of World <laughs> Records for the wrinkled, most wrinkled up Wrinkliest. pants. Wrinkliest. The wrinkliest pants. Omni Shield, Columbia <laughs> size 16, so good size. Definitely not no iron. Um, hiking pants. They've got the <laughs> roll up. So you can like roll them up and pull the loop over and button them. Cool. 
We gotta check all the pockets for money. I know when we go hiking, sometimes I'll have money in my pockets and forget about it. So I'll remember you've gotta that. Gotta check all the pockets. Check okay. your pockets when we go hiking. Your turn. I remember seeing this. This caught my eye because it was. It's bar three. Bar three. Which is sold, I think, at Macy's. One of my first purchases I bought to sell was a bar three leather jacket. I don't even remember if it was le uh, real leather, but it sold really fast. It's so, pretty cool. This is a weird print. Uh, kind of looks like marble. I think it's got a little bit of a stain at the bottom. No, it does, but I'll wash it. It'll clean it up. It is also my size, so I could possibly wear it if it... I can't get it out. Okay, what do I have? I have a humongous sweater. This will go in the... I'm going to sell it in the fall. Extra, extra small, but it's humongous. I said that already. J. Crew. Oh, nice. Really long cardigan. It's a new J. Crew, like from 2017. I love how they abbreviate the season, and the holiday season is Ho. So this is Ho 17. Acrylic and nylon and wool and elastane. This is from the sweater loft. And it's oh got gosh. cats. This is in our ugly Christmas sweater uh, collection. Collection that we're going to put Ooh, on. Look at the gold near buttons. Christmas. That's ugly. This is cats and. Yeah, that's cats. one of the ugliest ones I've seen. Cats on the arms. I think there's something and on ribbons. the back. And ribbons. Cats are playing with ribbons. And... What's on the back? I don't know. Just stuff for cats to play with. Ornaments. More. <sighs> that's that's a nifty one. Your turn. This is a I don't know what this is. I mean I do know what it is. It's like a shrug basically with a hood. This reminds me of stuff that um ballet dancers wear over their little leotards. My daughter's oh, yes. in ballet. Just also. sleeves. Yeah, it's like just sleeves and hood, but it's lacy. And has some embellishment. So, the brand is Spriggs. And it's organic cotton. So, that was a hint that maybe it's worth something. Size large. If I don't sell it, I'll let my daughter wear it for a while and be cool. Volatile. Yeah, these are weird. These are weird. Platform flip-flops. I remember stuff like this back in the 90s. I used to want to wear it. So we're going to try... They look very comfy. I didn't even see what size they are. It's eight. Oh, my size. Uh-oh. All right. Um, Not much to that. What else do I have? This, this is my last thing in my bag. Oh, good. Another so ugly much. Christmas sweater from Marissa Christina Classics. Knitted by hand. Don't know where the size is, but look at this one. Pom poms. Oh, it has a nice hole right there. I didn't see. Super. But it's not that big a deal. Um, gold beads and Dave was the inspector, so he may be fired. I'm fired. Are these J. Crew. Are they shorts or is it a it's dress? It's a skirt. So, oh, skirt. My bad. J. Crew skirt. It's a. It's corduroy. Navy blue corduroy. You can probably see all the fuzz on it. But it's a, like fuzzy. 2016. It's a newer one, so I will sell that in the fall. Excellent. You could give me something else to hold up. I just did. You did? Oh, this I got right as we were leaving. Somebody must have thrown it back. So it's Ann Taylor Loft. Not um, something I usually buy, but it's like a trench. And look at the the pattern. I like this floral. I don't like the. I don't like yellow, but I think this is a. Pretty floral for people who actually like yellow. Nice. Size extra large, did I say that? This is a hat Tara got. This is a vintage hat. HP Wasson Company? It could be worth nothing or it could be something good. I don't know. It's green. What, cool. what era is this from? Like the thirties, forties? A flapper girl. I think it's got some it's got some, I don't know what you call that, it's, chunks out of it? It's where the moths have... I didn't notice that in the store. Mm -hmm. Looks like the moths got into it. She also got this hat that says 
party on the moon, I think. Yeah, party on the moon. I don't know. I thought it was kind of funny. I'd drink wine on the moon. What? It's a party on the moon. Wine party on the moon. Wine. We drink I know, wine. I know that, but... I don't know if you uh, know this, but we're the thirsty <laughs> thrifters. We're is there anything else? The dry thrifters. What? Is yes. there anything else? Here, talk about this, Tara. Okay. This, I don't know if it'll sell, but... I do love bows. Uh -huh. The... Anything bow print. This is bow print. Black with, like, tan bows. It's a dress. From you, Lush. You have a brother named Bo. Well, that's not legally his name. Size small. Kind of sheer. I like it. Legally his name. No, it's not legally his name. Star Wars hat. Bo would like that. It, I don't think it fit him. I think it's a kid's. It'll fit him. Okay, another weird thing that I do not know this brand, but it seems like it might be something good. Spenco. S P E N C O. <laughs> The light is just out of But control. they're like red gingham sandals, and they feel like rubber. I didn't see the size. Maybe I should look that up. Size 7. Oh, gosh. I forgot. Sure. I have always wanted one of these. I need you to a stethoscope. be quiet and do I take a deep breath in. Breathe out. Okay. Do I have a heartbeat? In. Do I have a heartbeat? I can't hear anything. You, you talk too much for me to hear. You have to... <laughs> Nobody's ever we'll said that. We'll have to... So the brand is... Uh, Littman. Yeah. Littman Quality. If they're worth like $50, they will be sold. But if not, I've just always wanted some of these. Yeah, they work. It works. I used to, <laughs> I used to have a stethoscope in my doctor's kit that was Sesame Street. I loved that thing. If, if if anything, we can crack some safes with it. Oh, that's what we should totally yeah. do. Rob some banks, crack some safes. Is that the end of our haul? That's the end of our haul. So we got some 27 strange... minutes, 22 seconds. I can only read that because I have sunglasses on. This we got light. some strange items. We got some brands to try because everything at the outlet is pretty... Uh, Inexpensive. All this stuff from the outlet was, I think, $28 total. There was a ton of people at the outlet today. And a lot of kids. Because it's Sunday. There's like, yeah, 600 kids. <laughs> we need to go on weekdays during the school year. So, uh, that's it for today. I want to say thanks to my mom for my Doctor Who sweatshirt that I'm featuring today. I went out without a coat because I had my sweatshirt today. It was 40. That's ditch the coat weather in Indiana. Anything over freezing is <laughs> awesome right now. It's going to be 68 degrees on Thursday. Wow. There will be people like It'll probably swimming. rain though. It'll probably rain. It usually does. If it's warm, it rains. If it's cold, it snows. <laughs> Don't you love Indiana? Welcome to Indiana. And it's flat. It's awesome. <laughs> okay, we don't have a question. What's your favorite thing we bought from our haul right now? What was the coolest thing? What was the ugliest thing? Anything. That's two questions, ma'am. <laughs> Answer either or all. Whatever you want. Make a list. Write down a list of our questions. Ready? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> You remember the girls' question? How many how lights many in your time, house? No, how oh. many times do you turn on and off <laughs> the lights? Did anybody take notes on that? I don't think so. No one commented. So That's a shame. The world wants to know. <laughs> I started counting one day and then I forgot. It's not a fun activity. No. <laughs> so, all right, well, thanks for watching. Thank you for watching our haul. Cheers. To diet root beer. And ginger ale. That's good. Oh, where's the button? Oh, Lord. I don't know where the button's at. We lost the button in the hall. I found the button.